Let's go back to Lost Wing. So, we're meeting in Northreach. Sure are. But will I find Sid and Jill before this dame finds me? I don't know. What this is to me and my dog. I'm fine with that. I'm fine with me and my dog. I got nothing to worry about. What is all of this? Can I... Alright, so we may need to explore that way. Can I explore that way? If I can explore that way, then we won't fast travel. Yeah, let's, let's head this way. Torgal, you coming with me, boy? If it's me and my dog, then we're good. Is it safe to ride to Northridge now? No, it's not. I, I want to say Seth, but possible. Torgal! <laughs> it's me and the boy. Yeah, I hear you barking. Torgal! Hey, buddy. It's just me and you. It's just, it's just, it's just, it's just me and you now. When did you get so big? We got this. Look at how happy you are. It's just me and you now. All right, come on. Let's go fight some people together. Yeah. Oh, we got some more spiders. Actually, hold on. Let's change our rising flame. As much as it's fun to use, I want to try some other moves. No, nope. heat wave. It's pretty cool. This move is pretty funny. Uh, let's do ignition. Then these two are too good. I kind of don't want to change these. How many ability points I got? Five hundred. All right. Well, I'll just change one thing. Sub spider. Yeah. Get him. Yeah. Oh, you know what to do, boy. Ignition! <laughs> That's pretty cool. That boy says, shoulder charge. Shoulder charge. Alright, what we got? Hey. That's what you want. Burning there, boy. Ah. Get him, boy. Get him. You, you know, know what to do, boy. You know what to do, boy. Stay down. Yep. I wonder if there's gonna be a big spider boss. I don't know. What is that? Oh my god. You look pretty interesting, Dragon Avis. Togo. Get him! Come on. I feel like we've lost him before. Get him, boy! Come here. Get him, boy! Woo. Thought you had a friend. Come on. Keep your distance, boy. Let's go! Them You've got boys. Don't let them get away. Sick of Toggle. Sick of Toggle. Boy. Over here. You know what? Get him, boy. Yeah. Sick of Toggle. Ah, too late. There, boy. Over here. Woo. Got him. Sick of Toggle. Over here. Stop it. Give him all you got, boy. Give him all you got, boy. Get him. Let's get it. Woo! Keep your distance, boy. Give them all you've got, boy. You know what to do, boy. Sick of Toggle. You know what to do, boy. Stop it. Come here. Get him, boy. Get him, boy. Get him. Sick of Toggle. Let's get it. Nice. Nice. Got some more dragon talon. Eh. Griffin's head braid. What is that? What was that? What is it? What is what is 
What is it? Griffin head? What is this? Increase burning blade damage by seven. Ah, it's nice. Take this off since we don't use that no more. Um, heat wave. Nope. I guess we'll put this on for now. Actually, no. We have Wicked Will. Let's put Wicked Will. One of these days, I'm gonna have to take that Turgle assist off. But for now, no. That ain't happening right now. Got my awakening. We in the forest. What's happening in the forest? Chocobos! Where y'all going? I wanna follow the Chocobos. Chocobos! Hey, Chocobos. Oh, see, look, these are friendly. Why do the other ones attack me then? I don't know. There. Northreach. There it is. Uh, hold on, we got some enemies over here. Hey! Yeah, you know what to do, boy. You know what to do, boy. Come here. Get him, boy. It's over. Yeah. It's over. Boom! Come in, Turbo. Come in. Stay down. Boom. Nice. Hey, buddy. There, boy. Let's get it! Oh, keep your distance, boy. Get him! You know what to do, boy. Don't touch me. Don't touch me. Sick of Togo. Can you hit my dog? Don't hit my dog. Don't let them get away. Don't hit my dog. Flames and Reaper. Well. Ow. You know what to do, boy. Yeah, stop getting in front of the fire like that. Got him! Let's go, ignition! That was hella late. Don't touch him. Slice you up till you die. Alright, cool. Did it. I sliced him and diced him until he died. He's no longer alive. Three sharp fangs. Oh. Wall dogs! Sick of Toggle. Alright, Toggle. It's over. So what? You know what to do, boy. Yeah, Togo. Stay down. Sick of Togo. Sick of Togo. Get him. Yeah, here we go. It's over. Sick of Togo. Get him. Wanna go flying for a little bit? Let's go. Sick of Togo. Nice job, Torgal. He was in the air with me. Was... That was some real symmetry we had right there. What else do we got? Hang on. Excuse me. Oh! Oh, well, looks like uh, you can aggro them if you touch them. I didn't know that. Sorry, I didn't know. You know what to do, boy. Stay down. Stop it, Antelope! Yeah, boy. I don't want to do this to you! Get him! 
I don't want to sit here and jump you in the air. I'm sorry. Well, at least you kicked it. <laughs> What's over here? I see we got some flying enemies. Get him. Whatever these are. Oh. There, boy. Woo. Get him. Over here. Get him, boy. That's enough. Damn. Didn't stand a chance, huh? No scorpions down there? Scorpions! I'm coming to get you, scorpions. Come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. I'm sorry, those are Carlapos. But they look like scorpions. Woo! Go, get them all you've got, boys. Ah. Go! Get him, boy! New enemies are broken. Uh oh. No! Now's not the time! Cool. Stay back. Over here. Nice. Are you good, Torgal? What is that up there? Is that a wild chocobo? Oh, that looks like something else. I don't know what. But I'm gonna kill it. Hey! Weird thing over here. Oh! Look at spiders over here that we missed. Hey. Ignition! Oh, and we can move with it? That's pretty cool. I didn't know you can move with it. Yeah, boy! Get up, get up. There it is. Coming to get you. Toggle, save your energy. We got a big one. Never mind, we can't get over there. Actually, yes, we can. We can get right over there. Ah, cross this bridge. Hello, random stranger. We should probably get out of here. It's not safe. Where are those birds at? Raptors! Yeah! Sick of Toggle! We're in get Jurassic him. World again. Get him, boy! Yeah! Sick of Toggle! Woo! Woo! Get the move you've got, boy! Sorry, Raptor. Well, there he goes. That's all I wanted. Just wanted to fight the raptors. Anything over here? I wouldn't be surprised if there is. Hello. Oh no, it's a chest here. Yeah. I wish we could cross the waters. But I don't know. Maybe Clive can't swim. He can do everything but swim. And this random stranger right here. Alright. Well, I think we did most of the enemies I wanted to fight. Oh no, I see a few more. I see that one. Uh, those are chocobos. Hey! Excellent. Fuck you. Another fight. Get him! Get him, boy! Come here. Yeah. You know what to do, boy. Sick of Toggle. That's enough. Nice job. Nice one. Thought I saw a raptor somewhere. I don't know. Just got some wild chocobos. That's just sleeping. In the wildlife. Come on, Toggle. Let's head on to Northreach. Another town for us to... The soldiers used to speak oh. of a brothel. But that was north of the checkpoint. Uh, I hope the dame has friends in the south. Fish, fish! Fall from the sea of right, one way to find out. With the right to confiscate any objects... Excuse me. Be gone! 
The gates okay. for citizens, not serfs. All right. Um, Keep your hands to yourself. No one will buy anything that's been served by a branded touch. All right. Oh, well, he doesn't like me. Gotta find this person. Are you gonna buy a fast travel? Oh, however, do they get that color? There's a chest back here. I guess I take this chest. Got some black blood. Anybody want black blood? No? Have you no other bearers? Those two look rather... used. Used? Oh! Testing? Shush? Question mark? Hi there. A moment, my lady. A moment? <laughs> I doubt you could afford even that much of my time. Branded. My mistake. I'm looking for No, someone. mine. Upon reflection, you don't have the scent of a branded about you. Oh, but you know that the I don't. Flowers. Otto always did know how to please me. More than Sid ever did anyway. I'm sorry? Do you think you could please me, Clive? No. I cannot. I have my own woman, You're please. The dame. Got my own woman, please. Let us leave such impersonal titles to my less preferred clientele. You can call me Isabel. Otto assured me I could trust you. All right, I Isabel. I can trust you, can't I? Yeah, probably not with the pleasing part. You can trust me, yes, but. I don't know how to please a woman. Why would you? Help you? Because that's what we do. Long ago, Sid did me a kindness when no one else would. What was that? I have never forgotten that. Without it, I would not be where I am today. And so, I Ugh. make it a point to do the same whenever possible. Which brings us here. To the final obstacle between you and whatever it is you seek in the holy capital. I seek revenge. I fear the guards are not likely to let a masterless bearer pass unmolested. I'm sorry. Unless. Unmolested? Unless what? Unless. <laughs> Unless, of course, his master deigned to appear. Yes, that will do nicely. Sorry, lady, you too, honey, for but me. I shall expect a favor in return. Wait, what? I'm confused as well, Clive. <sighs> but you got yourself in some shit. Basically. Well, we found her. Can't do anything. Hey, what you got? And what can I do for you? Ooh, oh, yeah, I already have this. Uh, 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 uh. Nope. Oh yeah, let's sell the stuff that I don't need anymore. Um, where is it? No. Mm-mm. No, no, that's not it. Where is it? Ah, right, here we go. Kill bugs. Thank you. Uh, black blood. Get that's the here. best I can do. Everything else is used in crafting. Come back again. I won't. What are we doing here, Isabella? What the hell are you doing? Tut tut. We cannot have people thinking I tolerate disobedience from my branded. The men who gave me this are no more my masters than you are. Hmm. But it's not as if I can hide it. From the moment you acquired it, that brand has done naught but take. But today, it is going to give you exactly what you want. Just play along. You got it, mommy. Uh, what? Sorry. 
Madame. Back to the veil already. Pierce the veil. But of course, we must make ready to welcome you, my dear. And who might this be? Why, my new escort. The streets aren't safe for a girl, what with all the royalists about. <laughs> well, don't work him too hard. Well, that rather depends on you now, doesn't it? I'll see you all at sunset. That means don't fuck up. Because I gotta pick up your sleigh. Hold up. What you want? <sighs> Another fucking branded. Well, you're lucky you're with the dame. Get out of my sight, filth. Why'd you stop me then? That make no sense. Idiot. <laughs> that wasn't so bad. Wasn't so bad. They might have recognized me. But they didn't. And even if they had, they wouldn't have done anything about it. The gentlemen of the garrison are some of my best customers. We have an arrangement. What type of arrangement, yeah, girl. I. Now, if you'd care to follow me, please, no entanglements. We can speak more at the veil. I don't need that. <clears throat> Doesn't seem like I have much of a choice. No, you don't. So, sucks for you. Make for the veil that's well, also you. pierced. I me by. What's that talking about? And I suppose I'll need to get my coin purse. Oh. <laughs> Are you trying to get a handy from her? Sir? Lonely soldier? Torgo, don't look. Being grown over here. All these ladies being grown, Torgo. Yeah, get out of here. They being real grown. I don't like it. I feel a come And if anyone requests her company, tell them she is feeling unwell. Who? Madame, you look stunning. As do you, my dear. Mm. Shall I ask one of the girls draw a bath? That won't be necessary. Sir. Clive, my darling. No. Welcome to the Vale. Happy to be here? I'm not looking for any ladies. I already got one. Okay. Hey. Thank you for inviting me here. Thank you for seeing me through the gates, my lady. I am in your debt. Well, that was the whole point, wasn't it? And I told you, it's Isabel. You better call her by her name. Never wound you so tight, I wonder. It's certainly not Sid's influence. You uh, mentioned a favor. What is it you'd have me do? What is it? I don't want to keep my companions waiting. If you mean Sid and the girl, you needn't worry. They have yet to reach the checkpoint. How you know? Yes. Otto asked me to help them as well. Oh. But to answer your question, I need you to find someone for me. One of my girls. Tatienne has been gone for several days now, having left mm. no word of explanation. And I've begun to fear the worst. I feel as if I've spent my whole life searching for people. Though I can't say I'm any good at it. I trust you'll do your best. Oh, um, and take this. Is it another emblem? Yep. Got the moon and stars. Proof of that trust. And hopefully enough to keep prying eyes from looking too closely at that handsome face of yours. Oh, why thank you. Now, I have matters to attend to at the Iron Flagon. If you find anything, ask for me there. Iron Flagon? What is the Iron Flagon? What is that? What is that? Is that a bar? I should probably start here. Oh, and we got quests. Hey, I'm looking for a girl. You wear the dame's brooch. She must trust you. She doesn't. Enough to help me look for one of your colleagues. A woman by the name of Tatiane. Tatiane? She's still missing then. Mm -hmm. oh, if only I'd comforted her. What happened? You saw her before she disappeared. Tell me the story. The day before. 
She was in tears. She'd lost her comb, a gift from the dame. It wasn't anything fancy, but you could tell it meant the world to her. You see, Tatienne was an orphan, and she looked upon the dame as a mother, as do we all. So she was upset. And I didn't lend her my shoulder. But perhaps someone else did. Someone with the Tatiana penis! Shared a room. Her chambermate may have seen something. She's over there, sitting by the pond. Thank you. All right. Let's see what her chambermate can tell us then. All right, chambermate. Who's still your girl? Where's Tatian? So you're the new escort the girls have been talking about. Um, sure. And you've already been sent off on an errand, eh? Mm-hmm. Poor boy. You'll be knackered before the real work begins later on tonight. I won't be here tonight. I'm told you share a bedchamber with Tatian. Did she say anything to you before? Before she went missing. Only that she needed to meet with someone. She did mention a name, but I know exactly who she meant. Who? You do. Who? I'm an owl. From the garrison. Annoying little shit. Spent every gill he earned on Tatienne and picked fights with anyone else who tried to buy her time. Followed her around like a lost puppy. Tatienne was flattered at first. But it didn't take long for her to get scared. She thought about saying something. But the dame was so proud of her for how much she was bringing in. And she didn't want to let her down. This man from the garrison. Did you ever see him? Of course I did. Oh yeah, I'm about to say you He did. tried to sneak into our room enough times. Slimy sod's got a scar over one eye. Claims he got it in battle. You've been very helpful. Don't let him get away with this. Find him. And you'll find her. All right, cool. A man from the garrison. Seems a trip to the barracks is in order. Well, before we do that, we gotta save first. Save the game. It's me and Torbo. I haven't seen right. you around the Vale of late. Oh. Oh, don't tell me you've grown tired of us. Uh, it's Check it out. not that. The garrisons are being called back to the capital. Where to join the legions? Hey, you're not getting hard on it there, are you? Because Clive is watching. <laughs> oh boy. Alright, what we got over here? Excuse me, you uh, there? The gentleman with the sword? There's a lot of gentlemen with sword here. But what? I cannot help but notice you bear the moon and stars. No. So you are. An associate of the dame? More like her lover. Might yeah, I trouble I you for some assistance? You'll be rewarded, of course. All right, you caught my interest. And who exactly would I be assisting? Caught my interest. Forgive me. I am Etienne, a humble merchant, though fortunate enough to count the dame among my acquaintances. I have business beyond these walls, but the guards have grown somewhat suspicious of my comings and goings of late. I was hoping someone might be kind enough to go in my stead. Why me? I'm and a brandy. Who better than someone in the employ of the Vale's proprietress? Would you be willing to help a Ow. fellow in his hour of need? Uh, sure. Why not? Marvelous. Marvelous. task is. I love them. Oh, sorry. I skipped the dialogue by accident. He gave me something. There are three in total. A grocer, an apothecary, and a distiller. What? You need only mention that the items you carry are fresh from the master's table. Are you setting me up? Nothing dangerous, I hope. Why, of course not. Uh, merely trifles, which folk beyond the checkpoint are keen <clears throat> to get their hands on. You better not be setting and me up. Though I cannot prevent you from peeking, I advise that you don't. I'm going to peek through it. Strongly. Advise. Oh, I'm definitely gonna peek through it. I'm gonna peek through it. And if it's a setup, I'm gonna cut off your ankles. Alright, well, before we do anything, let's activate these other quests as well. Excuse me. Ugh. Heard the bones fell favorably. Ugh. To the veil, then. Hey. Hello. Nice I, man. I don't know how a bearer came by the moon and stars, but thank goodness I found you. Can I trust you to be discreet? Maybe. About what? About you love somebody? This. 
about what I wish to ask of you. About the fact that I, a humble creature, assist the Dame of the Vale in her endeavors. As unlikely as it may endeavors. seem, there are those within the upper echelons of Sambraquois society who find the Empire's treatment of bearers to be barbaric. Okay. All right. But what do you want from me? This town is carried upon the backs of its bearers, and yet many would see their servants starve. Not for the want of coin, simple fare cost little more than a pittance, but to revel in the suffering of others, a simple act of cruelty. Contemptible though it is, my countrymen would sooner cut off their noses to spite their faces than see their bearers fed. And despite my that. best attempts at secrecy, my efforts to dole out comestibles have been noticed. Which brings me to my request. The brand upon your cheek affords you a certain freedom. A freedom I could sorely use. The hell? What do you want from me? Fine. What do you need me to do? What do you want from me? Oh, thank you. An extra meal may not seem like much, but it will make all the difference. Here. Deliver these, but keep them hidden. Quickly now. Give me that. What food I can provide goes where the need is greatest. And today that happens to be the barracks. Mm. Three bearers, overworked and underfed, not permitted a moment's rest. That is kind of fucked up. It's no wonder so many die before their time. Tragic, true, but do not let anger make you careless. People will view this act of mercy as an undermining of the Empire's authority. Mm. Be discreet for both our sakes, and for the sake of those we feed. Oh, and when you're finished, a word in the ear of one of the Dame's girls would be appreciated. You won't be staying, then? I'm afraid not. I am expected back in the capital, and have already risked much speaking with you this long. All right. Just gotta fill it, feed some more of my people. The branded. Crystal's curse is bad enough. Alright. We can't let people starve as well. So far, uh, we can't. Sergeant's hey. got it in for us too. What you want? Where's your commanding officer, Branded? Don't you know the training grounds are for real soldiers? I'm better than hey, you. Hey, you lost or something? Sorry, but the Imperial Guard's got no use for your kind. The inventory always needs more bodies, though. I'm just passing through. Idiot! I don't bloody believe it! The bastard's wearing the moon and stars! That'll be why he's strutting about like he owns the place. I mean, I am the strongest one here. offered her our protection. You reckon this prick's really worth a couple of the Empress finest? <laughs> <laughs> I dare say there's ways of finding out. You trying to fight? How about it, Branded? Care to show us how you earn that brooch? Yeah. I'd rather not. <laughs> oh, no doubt. Only chivalrous souls that we are. Robin and I need to know Robin. The being are you Batman? Properly looked after. I mean, no, you're Leon. Fine. What do you want? What do you want? Your sad little souls. Fine. If it'll put your mind at ease. Because I'm better than you. Oh, and just so you know. I won't be holding back. I won't be holding back. I suggest you don't either. <laughs> Take a moment to get ready if you need it. Wouldn't want you whining about an unfair <clears throat> fight. And I don't want you whining when I win, so... Alright, I'm ready. Let's fight. Fight me. Now, let's get the measure of... Bite me. Bite me. If that's what Bite you me. want. Bite me. <laughs> Bite Cocky me. Cocky bastard. Bite me. Alright. Let's bite me. Here. Bite me. Pussy boy. He ain't gonna do nothing. He ain't gonna do nothing. Do you really want to do this? Oh, and when you go crying to your mistress, tell her it was Leon who gave you the pounding. Or listen here, Leon. You're not the Leon who I know. Use all the dirty tricks you want, Brandon. <laughs> you shouldn't have said that. You shouldn't have said that. Alright, so you know one Shut end up. of a blade from the other. What you gonna do? Yeah, I will never <laughs> Stay down, dummy. 
That's all you got. <sighs> Fuck me. No, thank you. I'm not into what you. What the hell are you playing at, Leon? Huh. <laughs> so it's a real challenge he wants, is it? Fine. Come on, Robin. You better go back to Batman or some of the, the have Teen some Titans. Fun, shall we? You think I'm scared of you? I'm not. Bearer, when the dang's favor anyway. Yeah. Oh, I know he went to hold my tongue for a start. <laughs> yep. Scared the man. Get up. Get up. You got potential. I uh -huh. Yep. I, I hear you loud and clear. Soldiers bested. I didn't kill them. I just bested them. I tell them to get out of my face. And don't ever try me again. Can I go now? Please. Wasting my Leave time. Gash. The bastard didn't even break a sweat. Nope. The dame's man or no, he's still a branded. Best hope the sergeant never hears about this. I hope he does. Yeah. Not after the bullet he gave us for missing drills. Might be the old side at a point. I'll leave you to it. I'll leave yeah, you. Yeah, good bloody riddance. <sighs> At least we know the dame's in safe hands, I suppose. It's okay. Do us a favor. If you have to tell the dame about this, tell her we got a good few hits in, eh? I won't. Hmm? <laughs> I will not. I will not, because y'all trying to get your little wee-wees wet. Nope, I ain't doing that. Get out my face with all that nonsense. If you want something, you gotta earn it. Right now, you two haven't earned it. The Emperor's finest, thrashed by a branded. All right. Sergeant, maybe a certain path. Ooh. Are you waiting for it to heal on its own? Hurry up! What an asshole. Looks like now's not the time. All right, so I guess we'll come back later for him. Um. Let's go to the other ones. Are you drying clothes? You look like you need a rest. There you go. This for you. Not half as much as I need this. Thank you. Of course, Has no it problem. always been this bad? Oh, it was worse before the Chamberlain. I'd be dead without him. Me and many others. Mm. That's something at least. Well... I'll leave you to it to dry your clothes. Your sheets or whatever. I'm gonna finish these, uh... Side quests. It's a dog. Hello. Oh, wait. The guy's right here. And side... Over here. Yep. Old. No, not you. You don't need it. You're healthy. You got shoes on. Here you go. You don't have shoes on. I have something for you. There you go. Take it. Take it. Eat. Regain your strength. From the Chamberlain. Thank you. No problem. You need to leave. Now. Please. Nah, don't worry Randy. about me. Who told you to rest? Stow those damn flames! And you! If you've got a message for me, out with it. If not, return to your post. Bro, shut up before I smack your forehead. Oh, well, never mind. Can't go around smacking people's forehead, unfortunately. Alright. What about this guy? What are we gonna do? What are we gonna do about this? Enough! Curse you! Get away from me! Dash! You'll work faster next time if you know what's good for you! It's not how that works. Eh. Yeah. It looks like you need it. Get your strength and smack his forehead. And be like, sorry, sir. And yeah, I was just trying to heal you. Chamberlain must have sent you, but 
alas, my work is far from over. If I don't go now, they'll beat me. You need to rest. But I won't. I've wounds to heal and bones to mend. Hmm. And what of your own hurts? They'll wait. That's all my hunger. Thank you, but... Yo, that man is broken. Yeah, you know he's talking? That's the sound of a broken man. A drover has more regard for his cattle than the Empire does its bearers. Anyway, I'd better head to the Vale. <laughs> crazy. That is crazy. Alright, well, let's head back to Pierce the Vale. And, uh, tell them about the good deed I've been doing. Yeah, still over here flirting. Well then, I suppose you'll need a little something to oh, remember me by. Oh, now I know what that means. Hey. All right. Are you here for business or pleasure? <laughs> yeah, business. Business, though not my own. The Chamberlain business. put me to work delivering food. Ah, so he found someone to help him then. Yeah. He Just did. as well. I hear his friends back at court have been taking a little too much interest in him of late. So he really is a Chamberlain. There was a time when he was the Vow's most illustrious customer. Us girls thought of him as a generous uncle. Uncle? He was one of the only people around here who seemed bothered by the way the Empire treats its bearers. Rare for one in his position. A fact not wasted on the dame. A little nudge from her is all it took, and he became the patron saint of Northreach's starving masses. Oh, nice. My sisters and I may have lost an uncle, but bearers are being fed for a change, so we don't grumble. Much. Glad to hear it. They gotta eat too. Y'all can get your money no Gives you faith though, doesn't it? To know there are people out there like him. And you, for that matter. I just do it for the money. It's no wonder the dame's got a soft spot for you. <laughs> I better be going. Quest complete. So I hope y'all can pick up the slack. Because I won't be doing this anymore. As far as I know. A twenty four twenty twenty forty twenty. Sorry, I got excited for a little bit. All right, so let's go deliver these purses, and then they be all. I don't know what, but they 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 exist. Oh, with the yeah. right to confiscate any objects forbidden by the throne. Okay, we're back. You there. What? A drop the no, I, I don't want nothing. Like I don't want nothing from you. Hey. I warn you now. I don't sell to your kind. I got, oh, Whether wow. you have the coin or not. Where's your master anyway? Up your ass. Etienne sent me. Didn't know he had his own bearer. Business must be booming. I got All a soda, right. if you haven't Quickly noticed. now, before the guards notice. Here you go. Ooh. That is no burden off my back. And this is for Etienne. I'm stealing it. All this for a drink. Not just any drink. The very best. Specially distilled for my most discerning customers. The guards find that. They'll seize it before you can blink. You keep it well hidden. All right. If Etienne likes it. Okay. Tell him there's more where that came from. For a price. Of course. Of course. Of course. Let me get out your way, because you're all like, Oh, you're Brandon. Oh. You're a big black scary guy. Oh. It's like tattoos. I have no business with Brandon. Oh my goodness. Well, I have business with you. Fucker. A package. Fresh from the master's table. I do not know you. Where is the merchant, Etienne? Somewhere the gate guards won't be paying him or his affairs any mind. Yeah. Fine. Hand over the goods and be gone. I hope you die. I hope you die for being a racist towards branded people. This is lighter than usual. Branded, if I discover you have played me false... Shut up! Nobody I cares. I can always take it back. 
Exactly. You would do no such thing. Mm. Your master should cut out your insolent tongue. Well, my master ain't Had here. Had you been the tool of any other man, I would see you clapped in chains. Well, guess what? You're out here hey, selling stuff. Take it and get out of my sight. Don't get mad because you live in a shitty life. Cigars. Those cigars are worth more than your life. Do be careful. I will. I don't like this man. If I talk to you again, I'm getting angry. So we're not gonna do that. You won't find Hello, Tinker. There's nothing here for your kind, Branded. Go on now. Shoot. Well, too bad I for you. Delivery from Etienne. Fresh from the master's table. So tuck it and shut up. Why didn't you say so? Excuse me. <laughs> Times are hard. But this here will make them less so. For a while at least. Sorry about the welcome. I meant nothing by it. You wait right here. Thank you. At least he says sorry. It makes sense for certain people. Thank you for saying sorry. You are right, Tinker. Yeah. You can tell Etienne I'm a man of my word. So we got drinks, cigars, and perfume. Perfume. Oroflam's finest. Just as promised. You got a special lady coming over? Perfume, cigars, and spirits. Hmm. Someone has expensive tastes. Someone I'm trying to get laid tonight. How can they afford to maintain them? Someone's about to get laid tonight. Any objects for them. Someone's about to get late. He got the cigars, the smoke to keep them all chill. Got the perfume to to smell all good. And then got the drinks to get a little loosey goosey. Cause they drinking goose. Ah Here you are. Have returned. I got your stuff. I believe these are yours. One, two, three. Uh, uh, uh. Take it. I don't need it. I don't smoke or drink. Delightful. Perfume sometimes. The dame will be pleased. You don't mm. say. And would she be pleased to learn what you had to exchange for those items? Mm -hmm. You mean the crystals? No need to be coy, my boy. Mm. Why not just tell me in the first place? An honest man wears deception like shackles about his ankles. I couldn't risk you stumbling under the gaze of the guards. After all, we both know the punishment for dealing in unsanctioned crystals, even such morsels as I provide. Oh, and if you don't know crystals. what this day's work may have cost you, then, well, I dare say you'll sleep all the better for it. Despite the risk, our friends beyond the wall gladly give their finest and most treasured wares for the paltry crumbs I trade in. I didn't realize crystals were so scarce here. As scarce as chocobo teeth, hence the thriving market <laughs> for even the scantest fragments. Good old chocobo teeth. Do you think it vulgar that I profit from the hardship of others? No. I think you're doing what you believe is necessary. You yeah, do what you gotta do. Indeed. And I don't doubt the dame would agree. A reward for a job well done. I have the goods I was commissioned to gather, and the guards are none the wiser. What did you just give me? I thank you. Does he give me a Ask meteorite? Our mutual friend when she hears of how you have aided me. What'd you give me? Alright. That's three questions one that I just did. Oh, it's at 25. 250. I don't know. Excuse me. That's everything. Alright. Now let's go back to these uh barracks. <clears throat> Wee. You still mad over yeah. here? That bastard! Accident, my ass! <sighs> Jesus Christ! His foot is turning to stone. Need some cocoa butter, my boy. It's not been half a moon since Bellinus tour. I need others march again. Yep. Sure will. That's what we signed up for. Oh. Heard the bones fell favorably. Hello? I'm looking for a man with a scar over his eye. Seen looking him? Looking for a man? Does this look like a brothel, Branded? 
Fuck off. Oh, you mad because I don't want Go you, big boy? He wears the dame's brooch. Mm -hmm. One word from him and the Vale's doors will be barred to us for good. Mm -hmm. <sighs> There's only one man in the garrison with a dodgy eye. His name's Yannick. I haven't seen him around lately, though. Yannick? What a name. On account of him being in war. Yeah, yeah, Yannick left a few days back. Said he had dealings with a merchant there. Oh, the dame thanks you. <laughs> Moor is the last village on the road to Oriflam. I should let Isabel know where I'm headed. Oh, Isabel! Are you still trying to kiss me? Or do dirty things to me? I hope not. Isabel, a moment of your time. <clears throat> Clive, tell me you bear good tidings. Kind of, sort of. That remains to be seen. I figured out where he's located, so I'm gonna see what's up. Go get some more info out of him. At wherever he's hiding at. Oh, Tatiana, you could have told me. Yeah. This Yannick. The soldiers I spoke to believe he's in the village of Moor. According door. to them, he claimed to have some business with the Shadow Moor door. Though that wouldn't explain his continued absence. And you plan on traveling to Moor to ascertain the truth? Yeah, why not? Isn't that what you want? Oh, it, it is, but I fear sending you there may cause more harm than good. The people of Moor are rather set in their ways. You'll find they have little love for bearers. Oh boy. And they will not hesitate to report one such as you to the constabulary. Hmm. There is a man in Moor who owes me a favor. More than one, in fact. His name is Bertrand, and he works at the stables. Tell him I send you. I shall return as soon as I find something. All right. We're going to mourn. Oh God, there's more over there. Let's get to it. We don't have much time to waste. We're in the village. Now we gotta go to a city. Oh, we just went from one city to go into another. Torgo, you with me? Come on, boy. Oh, look at this big old opening field. Look like a cornfield out here. Royal Meadow. Arathla, how many bearers suffer oh. to keep your granaries full? There we go, that cutscene place. What's over there? I'm gonna go check this out. A lot of chocobos here. Hey, chocobo. He's just staring at me. All aggressive. A little like he's about to be like, I eat your ass. I'm like, please, no. Not the ass. I need it. Get him, boy. Get him, boy. Nope. Oh, okay. Nope, wrong button. Sick of Toggle. Yeah, get him, Toggle. Sweet. What's up here? Let's figure out what's up here, Torgal. This might be a place where we have to come back on a mission. An Imperial Watchtower. Mm. Should be well stopped. Ooh. Hello. You what? know. You're not one of us. I can kill you guys out here. Don't let them get away. Get him. Uh oh. More enemy approaches. You know what that means? Hey, everybody? Oh no. You will pay for what you've done. <laughs> Get him. Whatever I please out here. Keep your distance, boy. Nice, Toga. Haha, <laughs> you try to get out of here. Get him. There, boy. Yeah. So bad. Give them all you've got, boy. All you got. That's enough. Keep your distance, boy. Get him, boy. Can we go inside, or we just got some? Ooh, what was that? Dement. What does it say? Dementor slash. Okay, yeah, I get it. We got a new place. 
What is this? Oh. Um. Sorry, I had a real dumb moment there. What is this? To main tier slash. Was that an armor? Oh. It was. Give me that. Hey, Torgo. Anything else? Or oh, is that it? If that was it. That's that's fine. A new little armor piece. Okay. Uh, let's see. We got raptors over there. Birds. Chocobos. Could go fight the raptors. I see some down there. And eh, we'll keep moving. Anything over here? Anything on the outskirts? On the ridges? I don't think so. A lot of chocobos out here. Excuse me. Chocobo, chocobo. Oh, they got windmills. You know, windmills be out here giving out powers. To the cornfield. The corn maze. Torgo, where'd you go? I can't see you. Oh, there you are. Go on. Where's everyone on right here? The I need you fit for the morrow's harvest. <laughs> oh, you're lucky. You're lucky you don't have a hitbox. Because you would have been sliced and diced. But that's okay. Maybe another time you can slice and dice you. Up, the lot of you. There's still work to be done. Jesus Christ. Hey. You, Brandon. What? Yeah, now. Oh God. You better be lucky. You got something that may be worth my time. You're late. What kept you? Let's talk about I'm late for what? Did they tell you nothing? A wild beast is savaging my boy. He deserves it. Well, don't just stand there gawping. Rescue him. Oh. Um. Okay. All right. Where is he? My. I see they've sent me a branded with a spine for a change. Alright, you're doing a lot of talking. He's over that way, towards the coast. Go, and see that you kill the beast. What else would I do? All bark. No bite? Haha. <laughs> Alright, let's go save your son. His son's in mortal danger. I don't he didn't care. seem all that worried. He did. Something's not right here. I need to be careful. Good eye. Oh, the wolf! It's going to eat me! Not if I can help it. Hey. Hey. Stay back. Stop I'll it. deal with this. Don't oh, let them get away. Get him, boy. Give him all you've got, boy. Give him all you got, boy. Don't let them get away. Stay down. Slice up in his ass. <laughs> he got bullied. That dog, that wolf got bullied. All right, son. You all right? What are you doing all the way over here? Anyway. No! You aren't supposed to kill Wolfie. You are supposed to die. Mm. Father will have you whipped for this. Mm -hmm. Bears aren't supposed to win. They never win. What is this? Your father said you were being attacked. You're not supposed to talk. Shut up. I'll do what I want. Stop looking at me like that. We were only having fun. Having fun? Why, watching people I'm die? Stop speaking. Father will hear of this. I don't care about your father. Oh, boy. All right. Oh. The wolf's work, no doubt. But it's not the wolf that's to blame. It's the dad. And the son. Fuck both of them. You're as shitty just as your father. Put an end to this before it happens again. Yeah, let's put it into it. Let's put some into it. Let's scare him. And be like, I'm Brandon not supposed to talk. And I'd be like, look. Do it again. I'm gonna be back. And I'm gonna shove my foot so far up your butt that you're gonna be pooping out shoelaces for weeks. You! Brandy, What's up? come here this instant. You told me to save your son, you idiot. How dare you frighten my son? 
Uh-huh. You slaughter his poor pet. Oh, and then this is sad because there's some people out here like that. Head held high. That wolf was trained. Mm -hmm. Better trained by far than your worthless kind. Then why is he dead? You are the entertainment, nothing more. And we are most certainly not entertained. Yeah, I could care less. You didn't Nor pay for am it. I. You'll pay for what you've done. Yeah, let's get it. See? I told you, he talks too much. It's not right. I don't like him, father. You're not the branded I bought, are you? Mm -mm. How dare you deceive me? Well, the sins of the slave are the sins of the master. Go! Summon the unlucky wretch you answer to. Can we choke him? Ooh! That wretch would be the dame! That unlucky wretch would be the dame. I can summon her if you like. Though I doubt she would welcome the interruption. Idiot. You, uh, you, uh, 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 uh the dame. Mm -hmm. uh, why would a woman of her caliber? You look afraid. What's wrong? Well, how do you think those bearers in the field felt? Can you imagine their fear? Their pain. And they're dead. From the look of you, I'd say you're starting to get an idea of the first. Now, if you need help with the second... Okay, oh, Clive. You're scaring me. Ooh. You think to threaten us, Branded? Uh-huh. The dame's pet or no, I, I will not abide such insolence. Can't we just buy another hound? A bigger one? A better one? Of course, my son. I'll have the villagers <laughs> fetch us another. Okay. With jaws... I'll kill that one, too. ...enough to nip this Branded's head... Clean off his shoulders. I'll kill that one too. Mm hmm. Keep it coming. I'll kill that one too. And I hope it's a behemoth. I'm wasting my time. But I can't just leave those bearers lying out there. They deserve a proper burial. That much I can do at least. Are we gonna do it ourselves or are you gonna get somebody to do it for you? Okay. How many bearers have lost their lives to this nobleman's sport? Yes, we're gonna do it for them. Torgal, watch my back. We gotta bury these guys. They didn't deserve this death. Come on. <clears throat> Excuse me. Y'all deserve better. All victims of the nobles' games. Raymond. You must be Clive. I am. How do you know my name? The dame told me. The dame? I'm in her service. Like yourself. <laughs> Never gets any easier. Burying the dead. No. Is that what you're here to do? The mistress has me see to it that none are left to the crows. Since you're here, can you give me a hand? Sure. Badly. I can do it. Let's put them to rest. I can do it for my peoples. My peoples! Gotta do it for them. For the one time. Alright, they're buried now. <clears throat> they are buried now. May their burden finally be lifted. I take it you slew the nobleman's pet? <laughs> I did. Yeah. Now I expect they'll find another soon enough. And when it gets here, more bearers will die. We don't want How that. How can they think so little of sending us to the slaughter? Simple. Because you are not them. Bearers are tools when they're needed, and toys when they're not. And if one breaks, well, you can always buy another. Still, such attitudes don't always go unpunished. That was more barking. Did he just die? Yeah. Is the child dead too? Is you're doing? Of course not. Wolves kill. It's in their nature. Invite one into your home. It's going to tear your throat out eventually. Same with bearers. Fed or not, they don't lack for fangs. What will folk do when they bite back, I wonder? They'd be scared. The realm's less two murderous bastards, and I won't mourn the loss. 
Yeah. For the help. All right, no problem. I'm glad they're dead. You don't have to. Nah, no, nah, Clive, take, take it. Care. You never know. Our past may cross again. It will. Till then. It will, Raymond. Because everybody loves Raymond. Bye, Raymond. Are they still over there? I want to see if they're still over there. I want to see their corpse. So I can laugh. Ooh, magic ash. Let's see. Are they still over there? Let's find out. They probably not, because they probably don't want to show a dead child. Oh, there is blood here. That's storytelling. So, yeah, they're dead. And the chocobo's gone. Togo? I think that was a job well done. They deserved it. That's all I'm saying. You know, karma is a ugly chicken. Hello. What's wrong with you? Um, have you seen my Chloe? Your what? I let her out of her pen while I did my chores. But she hasn't come back yet. Who's that? I think she's lost. Please, can you help me look for her? Who's Chloe? I can try. I can't promise I'll find her, but I'll try. Describe her to me. Who's Chloe? She's beautiful, white hair. Okay. She lets me stroke her when I'm sad. She's ever such a good girl. So quiet and kind. The she dog? likes walking in the wheat. I know the fields are big, but she's never got lost before. Uh -oh. oh, she must be starving too. She hasn't eaten anything since yesterday. It is my job to feed her. Okay, we will. In that case, let's not keep her waiting. Yeah, no need to cry. <clears throat> Playthings. So we're going out to the field. field to search. <laughs> yeah, yeah, there is. With a little luck, someone might have seen her. Has anybody seen Chloe? Excuse me. You work these fields. I need to ask you something. Hmm. A branded and an outsider at that, <laughs> judging by the lack of manners. Shut up and answer the question. Why should I help you, eh? You tell me that. Because a girl from the village asked me to find her pet, Chloe. Have you seen her? Chloe, is it? Oh, little Lisette's plaything. Mm -hmm. Last I saw, the filthy creature was sniffing about the windmill. That girl's old enough to know she should tie her pet up when she's finished playing with it. The windmill. I knew we was allowed to come back here. Off with you now. I won't have idle branded underfoot. Yeah, 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 shut up. You go back to sweeping your rocks. Pretty sure that I haven't been doing anything for you. All right, any luck over here? Is that the dog? Chloe. Chloe, what's wrong? <sighs> More brown than white. Hey, we saw you earlier at the other town. Oh, Chloe, are you, girl? You had the the paper. Is that? It's a dead body. Someone napping on the job. No, that's a dead body. I hope they don't mind the interruption. That's not a nap. That's a dead body. Told you. Oh. The crystal's curse. This must be Chloe. Chloe, I was calling you. Didn't you hear me? Hey, what? she's she's dead. Get up now. You've slept long enough. It's time to go home. Chloe? Why did you already turn into a rock? I only made you do a bit of magic. Oh boy. You knew you were my favorite. None of the other Chloe's had pretty hair. It could be months before Dad gives me another one. I have to wait until they're too tired to work anymore. Is that all she was to you? A plaything? Uh oh. Do you really not care that she's dead? She's not dead. She's a rock. That? The crystal's curse, that's just how she died. And now she's gone forever. Giving another bearer her name won't change that. No, don't, don't say that. It's true. And without that brat... That's right. Cross her dreams. She would have been just another girl. Somebody's daughter. 
Just like you. And she's dead! Dad said bears don't have parents. Or your dad's a butthole. They do. Parents that give them away. Families they'll never see again. But you became Chloe's family when you took her in. Remember that. And remember her. I... She's dead. <laughs> Quest complete. Make girl cry. <laughs> Alright, man. Hey, man. You okay? I'm so sorry, Chloe. Well, don't let your dad find out. Your dad gonna be like, why are you crying over a branded? We don't cry over people like them. And it's like, what do you mean, you people? It's like, Daddy, she was my friend. It's like, there's no way a Brenda can be a friend. They don't have feelings. That's crazy to say they don't have families. It's like, where do they come from then? Or don't have parents? <sighs> Say what, they come if from the, the people of the Pelican? are as intolerant as Isabel says, it's no wonder the Empire never sent my unit here. Hey, merchant. Oi, don't touch anything. You got anything? Got anything worth my time? Fire heat wave. Mmm. We got nothing. Got nothing. Chuggable. Hey, Bertrand. Bertrand. Are you Bertrand? Bertrand. The dame sent me. The dame has sent me. Sounds about right. Only time I hear from her is when she wants something. Well, go on then. What is it? One of her courtesans has gone missing, and I need to find her. A soldier who may have information on her whereabouts is rumored to have come here to meet with a trader. <clears throat> Many traders stop to peddle their wares on their way to the capital, but only one has been seen quarreling with a soldier. Mm. Is he still here? Where is he? The trader? Oh, yeah. Stubborn sod stood his ground till the soldier got tired of shouting, from what I hear. If you seek him out, keep your head down. Fact is, folks round here would sooner hang a branded than help him. And that's even with the dame's brooch for protection. Oof! Understood. Oof! That's a tough one. That's a tough one. Oh, Hello. Expecting any new branded until the new moon. Shut up. Hey, yeah. trader. What's this? A branded? Yeah. Where's your master? Must I call for the constable? No, you cannot. I come to you from Northreach. At the behest of the dame. Perhaps you've heard of her. Mm -hmm. oh, 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 why, of course I have. I am the good lady's servant. Mm, you're all that good. Oh, oh, what is it that she requires of me? Rumor has it you were seen arguing with a soldier some few days ago. A soldier with a scar over his eye. Where is he? Uh, yes. Uh, yes, that's right. Where's the bastard? He had a comb which he <laughs> claimed was an antique. Said he wanted to trade it for a newer one. What kind of comb? But although it was an antique, it most certainly was not, as I told him. And nevertheless, he insisted that it was of great value and was quite vehement about my appraisal. I stood firm, however, mm. and for all his bluster, he still purchased a new comb, huh? albeit an inexpensive one. And do you know where he went after that? My customers aren't usually in the habit of telling me whither they are bound, but as it happens, this one did. Hmm. Yonder ruins, strange as it may sound. Why is he over there? Not at all. I would do anything for the day. Anything. Anyone. I know you would, you uh, horny boy. Be sure and tell her, won't you, that I was helpful. I mean, most helpful. I won't. I will not tell her. Because, uh, all y'all want is some booty. Priest! You are fortunate to have fallen into the dame's good graces. Am I? But her influence wanes the further you stray from Northreach. Remember that. My way would land. All right, no problem. I just know not to get in trouble. Cool. We got some more enemies over here. That's a rock. That's a rock. Never mind. I thought the rock was enemies. 
Bluebird, Kevin, is that you? Yeah, boy. Uh -oh. Keep your distance, boy. Well, I don't want to do this to you, Chocobos. I just wanted the bluebird. Don't let them get away. You know what to do, boy. Come on. Chocobos, I don't like doing this to you. Keep your distance, boy. Sick of Togo. Get on, Togo. Keep your distance, boy. Yeah! Yeah, boy! My wounds, yeah. boy! My wounds, boy! A little help! Togo! 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 My wounds, boy! Togo, my wounds! A little help! My wounds, boy! My wounds, boy! A little help! My wounds, boy! My wounds, boy. My wounds, boy. My wounds, boy. Right, cool. Just have you heal me too far to notice. Guess we're going up this way. Um, anything else over here? Mm, hold on. Something down there. What is it? What is it? What is it? What Not is much it? chance I'd make it through the penitent's gate without someone recognizing me as a deserter. Yeah, so I know. Had better have a plan. Yeah. Because if not, then we are. Fuck. Unless you want me to destroy everything, that'll be fun. But I feel like it's as we're doing this. Here, Togo. Uh oh. Smells real bad. We can't let them get any closer to the village. No, we can't. Yeah, here, wolves. Get the wolves going for them. Get a boy. Yeah. You know what to do, boy. Sick of Toggle. Sick of Toggle. But, uh, what was I about to say? I was going to say, as we're doing this, I feel like. I feel like our home is gonna get attacked by uh Buck Guy because we killed his beloved Benedict truck. Even though she was like out of people. Come on, dude. Get him. Ooh. Get him. It's over. Punch. Enemy slain. Toggle's barking in the back, cause that's how we do Toggle. That right. All right. Damn it all. Bodies. A oh, man. It's not good. Mm -mm. Oh. Well, the wolves have been busy, but the blood is long dry. That's the girl. There's the calm that the guy was talking about. So it is you. Tatian. Damn it. It's too late. If that's true, then the body next to hers will be Yannick's. Yeah. The girl Yannick went off to sea every night. You said her name was Tatian. You. Did you follow me? Now why would I do that? Hmm? Unless you think I'd have good reason to. But no. I was sent to find Yannick. By nope. the looks of things, I have. Job well done, I guess. We both found who we were searching for. Yeah, he was a jealous sod. Couldn't stand the thought of his woman with someone else. <laughs> then one day he sees her with a new comb. Thinks she's got herself a new gallant. Tells the garrison he's going to find the man and kill him. We know he's all talk, but then he disappears off to more for some dealings and doesn't come back. If you mean this comb, it was a gift from the dame. <laughs> if only Yannick had bothered to ask, eh? Dang. Boy got I jealous that he went haywire. Hill. I think he meant to ask her something else. He stole the old comb and bought her a new one in the hope they'd wed. Wed? Where would they have gone? Certainly not back to Northreach with a dame waiting. And we all know what happens to deserters. Now you're looking at one. Tell the dame I'm sorry for her loss. I will. When the lads come to collect Yannick's body, I'll see that Tatian is delivered to the Vale. Is that wise? 
Oh, there won't be any covering up this mess. The most we can hope for is that the dame doesn't hold it against us. Speaking of which, I saw her in Moor just now. Could you tell her what happened? Might sound better coming from you. Um, uh, not much of a choice. I'll be honest with you. I ain't got too much of a choice, so... I need to tell Isabel. Have the comb. Perhaps the comb will give her something to remember Tatienne by. Dang it. We was too slow, Torgo. We got distracted. With the side quest. Was it worth it? Probably not. People are just dying left and right. I hate it here. Hey. If it was a message that needed delivering, I could have seen to it, my lady. Of course you could. Had hey. it not been personal. What y'all talking about? Can I join You're in? We're still in one piece, I see. For now. You will be pleased to hear that your companions have arrived. Mm. They said they would meet you at a little chapel to the east of here. Thank you, but you needn't have come all this way just to tell me. I was on my way to see you. Yeah. You, you found her then? Yeah. She didn't make it. She did. She didn't make it, sorry. The dick was too good to handle. She died from a good see. dick. My dear Tati. Sorry. It is by no means uncommon for a client to fall for a courtesan. Especially a client who's young and far from home. Can you blame him? But rarely do such tales have happy endings. She put that not good good on him. I he was like this I'm with love. I believe it was yours. Here you go. Was this comb yours? Thank you for returning it. I shall see that it has a place on her pyre. Torba, what are you doing back there? <laughs> Just hear somebody growling and sniffling. 200 experience. And a stimmy check for gold. I got some more meteor. I should go. Goodbye. Before you do. No. I have one last gift. Oh, yes. I like gifts. A token of my thanks. Give me the gift. The veil counts among its patrons several high-ranking officers of the Imperial Army. Mm -hmm. According to one of the looser-tongued gentlemen, mm. it would appear that the legions are planning to march south. Why south? Not to mention the same thing. Ah. But did he mention that it was all of the legions? What do you mean? This is no mere skirmish. Were I to guess, I'd say the Emperor planned to abandon the capital. Uh oh. But that couldn't possibly be true now, could it? Take care, Clive. You never know. I will. And thank you again. A war is a coming. Say bye to Torgal. Why are everybody acting like Torgal's not here? Torgal, come here. It's like pitch. I love you. You're a good boy. I love you, buddy. If you die at the end, this game is ass. After it. <laughs> Alright, cool. Alright, cool. We don't got nothing else here right now. It's my now, turn. We Let go up there. Try. Yeah, we do. We. Yes, we do. I see the pathway now. I'm running behind the house like I'm a little kid. They were the priest again. Hey, priest. See you later. Let's go meet up with Sid and Jill. See what's our plan to invade this capital to steal this crystal while our home is possibly being invaded. Got real quiet. Hello? Anybody here? Somebody make a noise if you're here. And... Oh! Hmm. Got a cutscene? Oh, they get close. Oh, we got a cutscene. Shh. 
We got. Uh, excuse me. Hey, Sid. Any trouble on the way? Hey, Jill. None worth mentioning. As I was telling Jill, it's worse than I thought. The capital's crawling with soldiers. They should probably walk then. And here I am, the deserter come home. Which is why we'll be taking the back door. Oh, the back door, you say? Hmm. 